Now, I have this question for you, and it is, what is the greatest possible length which can be used to measure exactly the length 8 meter, 4 meter, 20 centimeter, and 12 meter, 20 centimeter? Now, there's something you need to observe in this question. What you need to observe in this question, there is a presence of centimeter and a presence of meter. The first thing you are going to do, you need to change all of them to the same unit. Either you change them to minutes, or you change them to meter, or you change them to centimeter. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to change all of them to centimeter. That's the first thing I'm going to do. So 800, if you change it to centimeter, because 8 times 100, which will give you 800 centimeter. The second one times 100, which is 400 centimeter. 20 centimeter remains the same. Now coming over to this, you just need 12 meter times 100, which is 1,200 meter plus 20, which will give you 1,220 centimeter. Now, the next thing that we are going to look for in this question is greatest possible length. Now, you might be asking what is this greatest possible length you can use in all this. Now, the answer there is just there. What they are asking from you is the highest common factor. That is the HCF. Now, first of all, we are going to look for the highest common factor of all of these. Uh, how do we solve the highest common factor? We draw our line. And what can divide in all of them? First of all, 10. Let us use a bigger number. 10 divide 800, it gives you 80. 10 divide 40, 400, it gives you 40. 2, 1, 2, 2. What again can divide? 2, 2, 40, 20, 1, 6, 6, 1. So HCL, because we have already reached 1 here, yeah? we stop. So, the HCF there is 10 times 2, which is 20 centimeter. So, the greatest possible length that we can use to measure everything and got it perfectly is 20 centimeter. What you can do for me is to click on the follow button and share if you love what we did today. See you next time.